Greetings, I'm Chris and welcome to episode 1 of my In Skyrim series, where we take an iconic fantasy class and play them in the vast open sandbox Skyrim has to offer. In this series we'll be playing as the master of minions, power hungry warlock from the world of Warcraft MMO. Key things to note about this playthrough, we will be looking to massively invest in conjuration for the best most powerful spells it has to offer, exactly like the world of Warcraft game with huge amounts of spell damage, in particular fire damage and perhaps lightning and maybe some kind of shadow damage by delving deeply into destruction, warping our enemies' minds through use of fear and similar spells. We'll be looking to fill up our health and magic through the use of alchemy and hopefully use that as a vehicle to generate gold, ideally not touching into restoration unless we have to. As we get higher in level through talents and gear, we'll be looking to output significant amounts of damage in a short period of time and of course during our travels enjoying the sights quests and incredible lore skyrim has to offer really excited to play this i've been thinking about it for a long time and um, i'm really interested to see where it goes and see what we can do um, trying to adhere to the character specialization of the warlock um, class As we progress through the game, um, we'll have to start through some of the uh, standard quests, but as we move forward we'll be looking to get significant items that uh, help us become a, a more conjuration heavy um, caster build. Still have an organic playthrough as well, exploring as we go, enjoying all the, uh, the sights Skyrim has to offer version of this is the uh, special edition version so that's got all the DLC on it and this is with the anniversary update but if you've just got the standard vers version of Skyrim that's absolutely fine I'm gonna stick with uh, an unmodded uh, playthrough of this so um, absolutely feel free to play along um, and add your own twist to it as well and I'd love to hear about that if you uh, hey, want to comment you. in the, uh, in the comment section you were trying to cross the border right Walked right into that Imperial ambush. Same as us. And that thief over there. Damn you Stormcloaks. Skyrim was fine until you came along. Empire was nice and lazy. If they hadn't been looking for you, you could have stolen that horse and been halfway to Hammerfell. You there. You and me. We shouldn't be here. It's these Stormcloaks the Empire wants. We're all brothers and sisters in binds now, thief. Shut up back there. What's wrong with him, huh? Watch your tongue. You're speaking to Ulfric Stormcloak. If you do note any uh, quests you think are, are worthy for me to look at, any items or characters to visit, please do let me know as well. It's been quite a while since I've played Skyrim, quite a few years, so it's good to be back. I don't know where we're going, but Sovngarde awaits. No, this can't be happening. This isn't happening. Hey. What village are you from, horse thief? Why do you care? A Nord's last thoughts should be of home. Not too sure if we're going to get um, politically aligned in this, but um, we'll just see how the uh, how the character progresses and grows, and see where it takes us. Good. Let's get this over with. Sure. Mara, Debella, Kinnereth, Akatosh. There's really many ways to play the Warlock class, um, but with the uh, the Blizzard World of Warcraft way, I think we'll be doing it with a pretty standard non-use of uh, healing powers, um, minions, magic, mind control kind of build. That being said, uh, damage in Skyrim as you level um, does fluctuate quite high, so we may run into trouble doing that, and if we do, then we'll just either change the difficulty or or use some healing to help us out. I used to be sweet on the making this play through uh, challenging but fun. Is still making that mead with juniper berries tasty. Funny, when I was a boy, imperial walls and towers used to make me feel so safe. Where are they going? To go inside the tunnel. Why? I want to watch the soldiers. Inside the house. Now. Yes, Papa. Get these prisoners out of the carts. Move it! Why 
we stopping? Why do you think? End of the line. Crazy how calm this guy is, considering he knows what's about to happen Let's to him. Let's go. Shouldn't keep the gods waiting for us. No, wait, we're not rebels. Face your death with some courage, thief. You've got to tell them we weren't with you. This is a mistake. Get towards the block when we call your name. One at a time. <sighs> Empire loves their damn lists. Ulfric Stormcloak, Yarl of Windhelm. It has been an honor, Jarl Ulfric. Bailoff of Riverwood. No care of Rorik step. No, I'm not a rebel. You can't do this. Halt! You're not gonna kill me! Archers! Anyone else feel like running? Wait. You there. Step forward. Who are you? So in terms of the class, or should I say the um the race, um I've I was looking at Orc, but I did like the look of uh a high elf, um uh, known as the Altmer. Um it seems quite fitting with uh with the warlock class we're looking to play, um a character that um is power hungry, um probably so power hungry it's to their own demise ultimately. Um seems quite a high elf way of going. Um, they kind of have their own ends. They seem a little bit above everyone else around them. So I thought that would be quite fun. I, I was thinking perhaps Orc or even Khajiit, but I think we'll stick with uh, High Elf. That looks pretty good. Good complexion. I can spend a lot of time on the uh, character creation, so I'll try not to take too long. Don't really want to change anything there. Can go. Do I just check the eyes out again? See if we can't. Oh, interesting. Well, that's pretty cool. Demonic. Oh, that could actually could actually work. I think that's a little bit too extreme, actually. I think that was pretty good. Uh, color. This could be key. Thinking quite dark, kind of sinistry. Maybe not entirely black, but yeah, quite a dark, very dark brown. That looks good. Okay, I think that looks pretty good, pretty decent. In terms of a name, I was thinking something kind of. Uh, in keeping with the law of Skyrim, but a kind of magical elfish name, so something like Alandor. You are not with the Thalmor Embassy, are you, High Elf? No, that can't be right. Captain, what should we do? He's not on the list. Should actually say yes. yes Forget I am. the list. He goes to the block. By your orders, Captain. I'm sorry. We'll make sure your remains are returned to the Somerset Isle. Follow the captain, prisoner. Pretty brutal. Still think it's an incredible uh, way to start the game. Some here in Helgen call you a hero, but a hero doesn't use a power like the voice to murder his king and usurp his throne. You started this war. Plunge Skyrim into chaos, and now the Empire is going to put you down. 
and restore the peace. What was that? It's nothing. Carry on. Yes, General Tullius. Give them their last rites. As we commend your souls to Aetherius, blessings of the eight divines upon you. For the love of Talos, shut up and let's get this over. As you wish. Come on! I haven't got all morning. Absolutely stoic. My ancestors are smiling at me, Imperials. Can you say the same? You Imperial bastards! Justice! Death to the Stormcloaks! As fearless in death as he was in life. Next, the High Elf! There it is again. Did you hear that? I said, next prisoner. To the block, prisoner. Nice and easy. What in oblivion is that? Sentries, what do you see? It's in the clouds! That is excellent timing for us. What is that thing? Would the legends be true? Legends don't burn down the ages. We need to move now! Up through the tower. Let's go! We still have our uh, hands bound, so we can't do much. This way, friend! Oh! General Tolias and join the defense. Gods guide you, Hadvar. Stay close to the wall. I mean, I guess he was just following orders before. Oh. Quickly, follow me. Pretty impressive, even now. Ooh, I think it's time to move. Wow. Solemn guard, brother. 
Looks like we're the only ones who made it. That thing was a dragon, no doubt. Just like the children's stories and the legends. The harbingers of the end times. We better get moving. Come here. Let me see if I can get those bindings off. Very kind. Come on. You need your hands free. There you go. May as well take Ganyar's gear. He won't be needing it anymore. We're kind of bad doing that, but okay. Alright. Get that armor on. Give that axe a few swings. I'm going to see if I can find something. Get out of here. Ah, this one's locked. Let's see about that gate. See if we've got any magic spells as well. I think we start with a couple. Great. So we've got flames, we've got fury. Creature and people up to level 6 will attack anything nearby. We'll probably be using that one. We have a highborn um, racial ability to regenerate magicka faster for 60 seconds and we have healing which we'll try not to touch too much but as i say if we need to we need to um so we'll favorite flames great and we will get our sword um we'll not really use melee uh, as a warlock too much but um Sticking to the class, we'll use staves, daggers, swords, uh, in a pinch if we have to. Or our fists. Damn. No way to open this from our side. Come it's on. the Imperials! They cover! There's a woman that tried to kill me. Oops, sorry, sorry. Maybe one of these imperials have And that is just this. So we'll take the sword, the dagger, the key. Won't be really delving into heavy armor. Keep a few daggers. So we've got a weapon now as well, so we will uh So we've got a, a weapon and a spell. That's it. Come on, let's get out of here before the dragon brings the whole tower down on our heads. Kind of seems weird to see a high elf in this armor. Hopefully, we get something a little better. Doesn't give up easy. Grab everything important and let's move. Dragon's burning everything to the ground. I just need to gather some more potions. Imperial dogs! The prisoners are so Interesting cutscenes. And uh, see what we can loot here. Potions are going to be very useful in our playthrough. We'll be looking to uh, to to make some really high quality potions, health potions, magicka, poison. Food. We will probably be eating a lot of food. We're going to be a very well fed warlock. Done. Let's get moving. In terms of morality, um, probably the classic warlock trope of working towards their own ends. It may be to a good cause or a bad cause, but it does serve them ultimately. Looks 
like there's something in this cage. Ah, it's locked. See if you can get it open with some picks. We might need that gold once we get out. Grab anything useful up there. Go. Lock picks and healing, brilliant. Book of the Dragonborn. Many people have heard the term Dragonborn. We are, of course, ruled by the Dragonborn Emperors. But the true meaning of the term is not commonly understood. For those of us in the Order of Talos, this is a subject near and dear to our hearts. And in this book, I will attempt to illuminate the, the history and significance of those known as Dragonborn down through the ages. Lore is really heavy in this game and there are a lot of books to collect with huge amounts of information on so I won't go through a, a full read through but we will uh, browse through and collect as much as we can and obviously if you want to pause and read through it at your leisure you're more than welcome to. I've read through them uh, previously in other, other gameplays years ago, so I'll probably pick through them again uh, uh, when I'm not uh, recording gameplay footage. So we've got uh, Minor Magicka, some coin. And Spell Tome Sparks, brilliant. And he's a mage as well, that could be really handy for us. So gold, Magicka, Novice Hood, increases Magicka by 30, we'll definitely need that. Novice Robes, Magicka regenerates 50% faster. Unfortunately we are going to have to take the poor fella's clothes, because we will need those. Got our hood and robes on. And here we have if we can't learn that book. Brilliant. How do we look? Good, good. Very, very castery, very magic-like. Hopefully we'll be able to upgrade and enchant our own gear at some point soon as well. Someone knows where we're going. I was, um, I was following you. Orders are to wait until General Tully has arrived. I'm not waiting to be killed by a dragon. We need to pull back. Just give the general some time. Oops, just caught him with that. That's pretty unfortunate. A lick of that. Brilliant. Okay. It's kind of weird playing in a third person view. Oh dear. Don't really want to ignite that. Can't just loot up a little bit. Get a few things to sell without becoming too uh, encumbered. I 
ideally get some better boots as well. Sounds like a good idea. Hmm. I'm curious, what is this way? Interesting. A potion. Yeah. That doesn't go anywhere. Ouch. I guess we'd better try this way. can get frostbite venom a blood freezing poison that does five points damage to health and stamina for four seconds Many eyes, you know? i agree i'm not a big fan of spiders myself we just have to be very careful with our uh, with our health Maybe actually take a bite of food. Once we've collected something a bit better. Hold up! There's a bear just ahead. See her? I'd rather not tangle with her right now. Let's try to sneak by. Good idea. Nice and slow. And watch where you step. Or if you're feeling lucky, you can take this bow. Might take her by surprise. Go ahead. I'll follow your lead and watch your back. See if we can't get powerful sneak attack with fire. In terms of difficulty we're playing on adept um, once we actually get out into the world proper we can kind of uh, calibrate that a bit better to our playthrough making things challenging but enjoyable hopefully if we do well we'll be playing on a really high difficulty um, so you get to mid and end game that looks like the way out i knew we'd make it in terms of scaling of the game the characters do get quite tough in terms of health and armor 
survival mode adds the need to eat, sleep, and stay warm. I don't think we'll be doing it on this playthrough, but it's something to consider in future gameplays. Wait. There he goes. Looks like he's gone for good this time. No way to know if anyone else made it out alive. But this place is going to be swarming with Imperials soon enough. We better clear out of here. My sister, Gerder, runs the mill in Riverwood, just up the road. I'm sure she'd help you out. It's probably best if we split up. Good luck. I wouldn't have made it without your help today. I wouldn't have made it without your help. You pretty much saved my life. And that's it. We are now officially in Skyrim. First quest done. Just a lone, uh, a lone caster, a couple of spells, an old weapon, and some uh, cloth armor, and we'll see what we can make of ourselves. Did you miss me? He's back. Wouldn't do without me. Pick up herbs as we go along. Not to get too distracted, but just to um, get a good supply. You know, you should go to Windhelm and join the fight to free Skyrim. You've seen the true face of the Empire. Monarch here Butterfly. Today. If anyone will know what the coming of the dragon means, it's Ulfric. We will be doing that as well. Um, we'll be working through the starting area in Helgen. Um, all the way up to White Run, just to uh, expand the storyline out. Um, probably go to High Hrothgar as well um, to um, learn our shouts. Not too sure what we'll be doing with them just yet, but we'll see how things go. Touching into some of the darker storylines, so we'll be delving into things like the uh, the Thieves Guild, the um, the Dark Brotherhood. Maybe not too deep, but enough to kind of fit in with the uh, the class fantasy of the Warlock, so we can access the more darker quests and explore. We'll be working heavily in uh, in terms of uh, the mage and magic quests. Bleak Falls Barrow is going to be one of our first places we can really quest as in a dungeon to kind of um, get to grips with the class, challenge ourselves. Hopefully get some good conjuration spells soon. Stone, the Mage Stone, and the Warrior Stone. Um, the Mage Stone will, from what I remember, um, boost our, our magic based skills and experience through that, and um, so we will go with that. Under the sign of the Mage, we'll learn all magic skills 20% faster. You may only have one blessing at a time, so we will accept that. Mage, eh? Well, to each his own. Is an incredible uh, view as well. I actually forgot how good the graphics are in this game. It has received many, many updates over its life, but um, yeah, they've done a fantastic job. The current incarnation of this game is now on the Nintendo Switch.
Remember, this isn't Stormcloak territory. If we're ahead of the news from Helgen, we should be fine. As long as we don't do anything stupid. If we run into any Imperials, just let me do the talking, alright? decided to come with me. We're almost to Riverwood. See what um, quest we've got. Nobody here knows what happened. To me. Come on, Gurdon's probably working in her lumber mill. A dragon! I saw Did a I dragon. see you talking to Sven? What? Maybe not. Maybe. Never mind. But I would stay away from him if I were you. It flew right over the barrel. Gerder. Brother, Mara's mercy, it's good to see you. But is it safe for you to be here? Gerder. We heard that Ulfric had been captured. Gerder, I'm fine. At least now I am. Are you hurt? What's happened? And who is this? One of your comrades? Not a comrade yet, but a friend. I owe him my life. Is there somewhere we can talk? There's no telling when the news from Helgen will reach the Imperials. Helgen? Has something happened? You're right. Follow me. Odd, come here a minute. I need your help with something. What is it, woman? Stand drunk on the job again? Odd, just come here. Raylo, what are you doing here? Ha. I'll be right down. Apparently you can make some pretty good money chopping wood. I'm uh, not too sure if we'll do that yet. Quite eager to kind of get out into the world and uh, see what we can do. Fly Amanita. Uncle Rayla, can I see your axe? How many Imperials have you killed? Do you really know Ulfric Stormcloak? Hush, Frodnar. This is no time for your games. Go and watch the South Road. Come find us if you see any Imperial soldiers coming. Aw, Mama. I want to stay and talk with Uncle Rayla.
And a ring? I can't take a ring, can I? Will it let me? It's a gift. I suppose I can. There is something you could do for me. For all of us here. The Jarl needs to know if there's a dragon on the loose. Riverwood is defenseless. We need to get word to Jarl Balgruf in Whiterun to send whatever troops he can. If you'll do that for me, I'll be in your debt. Midnight, sister. I knew we could count on you. I ought to get back to work before I missed, but did anyone else escape? Did Ulfric? Don't worry. I'm sure he made it out. It will take more than a dragon to stop Ulfric's storm. I'll let them into the house and, you know, show them where everything is. Hmm. Help them drink up our mead, you mean. Good luck, brother. So what we might do is we will just rest up here first. There's a few quests to get in this area. Which will be really good to get, just to get us acclimatised and to open a few bits up. So we're in Riverwood, we need to get to uh, right one at, uh, White Run at some point. Don't worry about me. I know how to lay well. And Relov's sister Gerda asked me to take word to Jarl right one, White Run of the dragon attacking Helgen. And to ask the Jarl to send soldiers to protect Riverwood, so we will go and do that shortly. I told you my sister would help us out. You were right. Got a nice ring we can enchant at some point. What are we doing for gold, actually? Um, Eighty one gold, okay. Okay, so we'll see uh we'll see what's here, see what uh, trouble we can get into. Well one of us has to do something. I said no. No adventures, no theatrics, no thief chasing. Did someone say adventure? Well, what are you going to do then, huh? Let's hear it. We are done talking about this. Oh, <clears throat> the customer. I'm sorry you had to hear that. Lucan Valerius. Well, I don't know what you overheard, but the Riverwood Trader is still open. Feel free to shop. Did something happen? Uh, yeah, we, we did have a, a bit of a we still have plenty to sell. Robbers were only after one thing. An ornament. Solid gold in the shape of a dragon's claw. I could help you get the claw back. You could? I've got some coin coming in from my last shipment. It's yours if you bring my claw back. Now, if you're going to get those thieves, you should head to Bleak Falls Barrow, northeast of town. Yes. So now you don't have to go, do you? Oh, really? Well, I think your new helper here needs a guide. Uh, no, I... By the eight, fine. An interesting stew. Show those thieves not to steal from Luke and Valerius. What have you got for sale? Oh, a bit of this and a bit of that. I don't think there's anything particular that we need. A child's doll. Fishing boots. Fishing map of white man, that's brilliant, okay. I heard they add the I did hear they added fishing into it, so that's gonna be interesting. Nothing we particularly need now. I wonder if we can sell anything. Morning brew mead. Uh, we'll keep one for ourselves for later to celebrate with. Sell the axe. Sell the bow. Probably cook that later. OK. 
Okay, we're not doing too bad. Just see what spells they've got. Do you sell spells? I think I have a few old spell books laying about. If you want more, you'll have to go to the College of Winterhold. Clairvoyance, Frostbite, Yuri, Lesser Ward. Lesser Ward could be something we'll be looking for. Oak Flesh, Razor Zombie. I was thinking about that with with a view to actually a warlock build. Um, I'm not too sure if we're going to go into kind of the necromancer view of spells rather than actual pure conjuration of demons. Um, we'll hold off on that and we'll see how things progress. Till next time. Got some lovely things. Lovely potions. Magicka health. Resist fire. Regeneration. We have to go through town and across the bridge to get to Bleak Falls Barrow. You can see it from here, though. The mountain just over the buildings. This way. I guess we're going there now. I would like to explore a bit more of the town first. Sleeping Giant Inn. Have a look in here. See if we can't find out the gossip in the town. Orgnar. Orgnar, are you listening? Hard not oh, to. There once was a hero yeah, named Ragnar the Red need to get riding to Whiterun from Old Rorik's stead. Did you hear me? And the bragger did swagger yep. and Ale's going bad. I guess you don't have potatoes in your ears after all. Just make sure we get a fresh batch in soon. But then he went quiet, did Ragnar the Red, when he met the shield maiden Matilda. Need a room? Talk to Delphine. I'm walking for work. Got any leads? Here, take a look at this. Some of the Jarl's men came by and left this bounty letter. Kill the bandit leader located at Rodoran's retreat. That's something we could do. Heard any rumors lately? There have been whispers. A boy up in Windhelm, name of Aventus Aretino. Been trying to contact the Dark Brotherhood. Very shady group I hear. Where can I learn more about magic? Looking to blow yourself up? I hear that's what magic does to you. There's a college in Winterhold that teaches magic. Unless that blew up too. Be a lot safer just to have the Jarl's wizard teach you a thing or two. Can I use the alchemy table? As long as you clean up, you know how to use it, right? Mix a couple of ingredients together, see what happens. A little wheat and blister wart makes a healing potion, if you didn't know. We have plenty of ingredients for sale, too. What have you got for sale? Drink for the thirsty, food for the hungry. Let's sate that appetite, hmm? Kind of pricey. 37 gold. 16 for wheat. Oh, we'll pass on that. Have you seen that shrine of Azura? They say the Dark Elves built it after they fled from Morrowind. Sight to see. That could be a, a really good quest for us. Um, it's going to be one we've got on our list of... Uh, quests and items to go for so it may not be something we get yet but um in the future i think is that it for we got rooms and food drink of course it's all in this note bones for a crow crow's tooth okay give me a mug of ale of course it's all in this note Missing merchant, brilliant. Okay, well that gives us a few, uh, a few quests. We'll just uh, do a bit of alchemy. See if we can't discover a few uh, items. Sure, these won't have any bad effects on us. Give me a mug of ale. Coming right up. 
You can create potions and poisons by combining two or more ingredients that share a common effect. Experiment with different ingredients to learn their effects. So, so far, oh, we can restore health. So we can mix Blue Mountain Flower with Butterfly Wing. Great. First potion. It's a start. And the time is 8 p.m. Might actually be worthwhile to set out the following day. If we can spend the night here. Talk to Delphine. Where that visitor been poking around? Word is Ulfric Stormcloak escaped from the Imperials. War is only going to get worse now. Sure thing. It's yours for a day. Brilliant. We'll rest up the night and go first thing in the morning. Enjoy the fire, the crackling of the uh, the logs. I'm guessing this isn't our room. Wrong room. Apologies. There we are. Fantastic. I would have thought that would come uh, complimentary if we got the room, but I guess not. Okay, so if we set off at first light, say about ooh, about nine hours. Hopefully, we can find a few uh, spell books in there to really uh, get our class up and rolling. So, what have we got now? We've got any miscellaneous quests. Got a good selection. So why don't we look to do the Golden Crow? I think that's quite an iconic um, quest when you first start Skyrim. It'll dark out. We'll just hit first light hopefully soon. And we'll head over there, just check the map. Hearing some incredible sounds. Just be careful, it can be dangerous outside to wander alone. And we've got wolves nearby. 
Just check our spells before we start, see what we've got. Caught a bit of fire damage. Beautiful scenery. Hopefully we are going in the right direction for it. I think we actually have to go around, possibly. Nope. Maybe we can cut across here. Bit of a uh, bit of mountain climbing before we start. attack. Lovely cutscenes. Hello friend. I mean you no harm. It's the friendliest animal I've ever seen. Oh well, and on we go. We've made an ally. Oh, that is not a good sign. I think I've completely missed the entrance to uh, Lake Falls. Definitely stay away from this chat.
Thunder's Kiss. Okay. Ooh. Whoa, 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 whoa. I don't mess with giants, and giants don't mess with me. Okay, we'll go around. A lot of times I've done this quest, and I don't think I've ever come this way. It's definitely not this way. Or is it? I, I think I took when I should should have taken a left at the bridge. I can fast travel back. Unless the um, path will take us there. Totally, totally out of the way. But it is good to explore. You never know what you'll find. Yeah. I, uh, shimmied when I should have shammied so we'll um fast travel back and take a left to help any way I can. And we're back. We've returned. Okay. Pretty confident this is the way now. So... This is it. Absolutely. It. That's a good sign. Okay, so I don't think these guys are going to be friendly. We'll see if we can't uh, pick them off at a distance and keep uh, keep away from them. Okay, they definitely aren't friendly. Hello, friend. Keep uh, between me and them. Allow our magic to regen a little bit. Where is this chap gone? Oh, there he is. Let's see if we can't roast this chappy. Probably actually do turn in the uh, difficulty up a little bit. Play a bit of peekaboo. Die, 
Excellent. Perhaps just eat a touch of food. Is anything nice in here for us? This is quite high up. Oh, okay, lovely. Sixty one gold. Oh far away from our target. Okay, still a ways to go. Just don't want to fall off. We'll plot on. Getting higher. Just run into that then, that was my bad. Also quite a nice bit. We've got a good carry weight, so we are uh, we take a few bits that uh, sell for ten gold or more. See if we can't get this guy ignited. see where there he is. Don't want to run out of magicka. He didn't really look like the bandit type to be honest. He looked more like an accountant but uh, okay. Garnet as well. Brilliant. Yes, even accountants need to make money in uh, in Skyrim. have a look out, enjoy the view, try not to fall off. Beautiful. Okay, let's enter. Brilliant. Okay, so I think what we'll do is we'll continue our Bleak Balls Barrow excursion next time. Uh, we'll we'll wait here and rest up and get ready to uh, what it looks like enter combat. So thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed, and I do hope to see you next time.